Hey guys, Jeff at Custom Crawlers here. Uh, in this episode, we're going to be breaking down the Bruder D5 on camera and showing you guys uh, some of the steps that we take uh, when we break this model down to get it ready for a conversion. So, I think the first thing that we want to do when we are going to break down these D5s is let's get our tracks disassembled and popped off of our unit here. Now I just I'm using just a standard a smaller standard screwdriver and pop down and those tracks come off very easily. Okay now after the tracks are off I think the next step in this disassembly of this D5 model will be to get these plastic pieces out um, where the track rides on. So in order to take these out there is a tab here a tab here and then one inside there. Now if we take and push those back here we can loosen them up come loose, well, not quite yet. Okay, that one, as you can see, is, is loose. Side of here and okay now we should be able to pop off this unit here well, I guess this one we're wanting to hold on to that shaft so we'll just take the whole shaft all the way out of there and set our parts off to the side here Go ahead and remove our rear drive and work on the same thing on this side. So here. That one's plenty loose enough now. Okay, there. Now the next step, we've got our tracks off, the next step we're going to take off our front blade assembly here. Now in order to do that, we can just simply pop up our fake cylinders here. A little bit of pressure down underneath of there and we pop those up and out of there. Now our front blade assembly here is held in by these couple detents. Oh, drop the unit here. Right there. So if we 
flex that back some. Let's get her flexed back and just far enough that we can get that released. Just see it pop there. And we'll do the same thing on this side now. So flex it back just to where it pops down and out of place. Then this is loose down here and we can take and lift our flex the sides of that arms up and around the side of the unit. And we want to be careful that we don't break anything here, but then up and off the unit. And we'll set them to the side. Next step on the disassembly of this D5 unit is we've got clips up at the front, two clips up at the front. We've got two clips right here, either side. Uh, we've got two clips at the front bottom of where the cab is here. And then there's actually some clips internally that hold in right there. Okay. We're gonna do this one like this. Get up inside of here. Pry that up. Do the same thing on this opposite side here. Get up underneath there. Start to show on camera and get to where I'm get the right pressure on it and I'm not stabbing myself. Okay. And our next ones here. difficult trying to do it on camera um, to show you guys how to how to do this here okay and then let's get these these clips up inside of there Read up. Okay. Took us to there, and then we've just got those last two up the back here from either side. And there lower shell and our upper shell are now all separated out. Get these pieces moved out of the way. So as far as our front goes, now I, like I said in a previous video, I utilize this front portion here and I will mount a standard size servo up inside of here, inside of the shell, to lift and lower our blade on our model. Now our internal portion here, where our gentleman sits, should just pull right on out and drops on down. Now, same thing here for this inner black portion here. If we flex those sides in a little bit from the windows, they kind of held in place. Um, by flexing out into the window areas. So you gotta work it a little bit here on all four sides. And so we can get our, that inner cab portion all removed. Now you got a couple other clips up at the top to take this top panel off here so you can get in and make some modifications to mount your LEDs. but. As far as breakdown wise guys, this D5 is pretty quick and you know, it's 
not a heck of a lot of stuff to take off to get down inside of here to begin on your conversion. Well, thanks for coming along with us as we disassemble this Bruder D5 dozer. Uh, if you've got any questions for us on this model or any of our other products, please send us an email at products at customcrawlers.com and we'll be happy to answer any questions you might have. Customcrawlers.com custom